Hello, everybody. Welcome to the Golden Goal Show, one of the greatest shows in the west side of the Australian Alps that are located in Ugandan. Okay, let's continue. But hey, everybody, welcome to the show. <laughs> and I am here with a special guest today, Mr. Edu or Rodney. How are you doing today, my friend? Hey, fam. It's your boy Robert here or Mindy. Oof, wait, wait, wait. I am doing phenomenal in the state of Nebraska, joining with my boy. Oh, God, thank you. Thank you. <laughs> lovely, lovely. Okay, and it has been an amazing week of football, honestly, so I, I can't even, like, we have so much to talk about. It's just beautiful. Big facts. The beautiful game. That is the reason they call it the beautiful game. And the one and only. It, it is true. And if we talk about in a British accent right now, we are going to be ripped in the episode because I do get comments saying, your British accent is so poor. And you know what I got to say that? You bought a twat. <laughs> so you bought a twat. Your mom. <laughs> so, so, so poor like Sancho. So, yeah, yeah, okay, yeah, that's a, <laughs> controversial, okay. But let us move on to the greatest league in the world currently. I mean, currently. So, the Premier League. So, it has been a great weekend for Premier League. Right now, Chelsea's in first, Liverpool in second, and Man United in third, followed by Brighton, hopefully and Albion, in fourth. <laughs> <laughs> Lovely. And Man City right after that. Okay, so, Newcastle League. Yeah, very interesting. <laughs> Big up Brighton, but okay. Newcastle leads United one to one. Saint Maximus scored. Rafinha scored. They are two beautiful talents. Wolves and Brentford. Brentford's one two zero. Get up the bees. Norwich City and Watford one to three for Watford. Go on uh, the cycling goalkeeper, as we know. Oh my gosh, Ben Foster. Love your YouTube channel. I know you're listening. You are definitely not listening. But let's continue. Berlin <laughs> Arsenal zero to one. Beautiful free kick by Odegaard. Oh my gosh. Um, Just kiss. Yes. Chef's yes. kiss. Yes. <laughs> and zero to zero for Southampton and Man City. Yikes, that's a bit of a shocker, but good job, Southampton, and their defense. <laughs> Liverpool, Crystal Palace. Oh, the Eagles. Poor Eagles. Three zero for Liverpool. Salah, of course, with the goal. And I can believe Kayate scored. I might be wrong. I am probably wrong. But hey, but good job for Liverpool. And Austin Villa <laughs> and Everton. Three zero for Austin Villa. Good up for them. Brighton. And Leicester City, 2-1 for Brighton, Hope Albion. I mean, get up for they, – they're doing phenomenal right now, honestly. Brighton, I mean eh. – Big facts, man. It's Brighton's been expected at fourth place, man. I know, Leicester and Leicester right now, 12th place. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Ooh, Jamie Vardy needs some help, man. Those youngsters need to start helping him out. Yeah, I mean, you do you lose in Golo Conte and pff, your world goes to uh, – I don't know, yeah. And Mars too. And Mars. Yeah. Yeah. And West Ham and Manchester United. Two one four. So I hate saying Lingardino. Lingardino. Yeah, the the actual goat of Manchester United, Lingardino. It's <laughs> facts. And then Tottenham and Chelsea. London is blue. Zero to three for Chelsea. All right, Rondi. So what do you want to get into first? Which game are we gonna talk about right now? Um, I think we need to talk about Chelsea, man. Chelsea. Because as a fellow supporter, oh my we're look. We're gonna. I think we could actually win the league this season. I think we could because with Lukaku at the top, he's way too clinical. Even though he didn't score today, he had chances yeah. and he finished well. They're on target, but yeah. just Tottenham had some good defense. It is um, true. and then we, and then we have the most stellar backline in defense of all time. Oh I think it's gosh. a it's a crime that Rudiger has seventy five pace on FIFA twenty two. Yeah. That man is okay. way too fast. Okay, I'm gonna go off right now on FIFA. They're, Go ahead. They're, I mean, as a, I'm a Chelsea supporter, but I am completely sometimes neutral for this show. And they did Chelsea so dirty with these ratings. It's Bro, we got assaulted. Disgusting. Mm -hmm. Okay, when Liverpool won the league, um, I mean, the Champions League like two years ago or so, or did they win it last year? Uh, I feel no, no, they won it two years ago. It was two two years ago, I guess. Yeah, they got five plus rating. Everybody, Alexander Arnold, Robertson, mm -hmm. Salah, Mane, Firmino, plus five plus Firmino. Plus oh yeah. Five. <sighs> Chelsea, they got either the same, or they got dropped one. That is disgusting. How does Asley Requeta and Tiago Silva stay the same and get a downgrade? It doesn't make sense to me. I, d I don't know. It, it's, it's, it's terrible. Dude, it's FIFA. What do you expect from FIFA? No facts. I, honestly, after the season, I would expect FIFA oh. to have 99 um, skill moves and five-star skill moves. <laughs> I could FIFA. definitely see it, see it at some point with the way he does things at the back. Oh my gosh. He, he, like, this is two games in a row where he's taken the whole field and tried to shoot. 
He's <laughs> crazy. And it's and it paid off this time too. It's no wonder he's getting like like interest from uh what's it called Real Madrid and uh, PSG. I mean, I would yeah, go for him. Chelsea needs to secure his contract for next season yeah, before he goes out. Yeah, I mean, they're trying to meet up with it, but we'll see, we'll see. But yeah, I mean, right. Chelsea, they uh, let me see. Diego Silva scored. Oh, Diego Silva, of course. He was mm-hmm. man of the match today. Great player. And, of course, Ingolo Kante came on and changed the game. What can you expect? The best midfielder in the world tied with Kimish, possibly. But I'd say Ingolo Kante is currently the best midfielder in the world. It, 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 oh. it was oh, – And I would have to agree with that, honestly, man. I mean, the way he changed the game from when Tuco put him in for, I think, Mason Mount because they needed a third midfielder in the, in the midfield. Yeah. change everything and then you have to give props to Tuchel as well for seeing the mistake that he made by having only two midfielders yeah. and changing the formation and solving the problem instantly yeah that's true it is true and then of course uh scoring the second goal on Colocante the beautiful man he is what a deflection a huge deflection <laughs> off Dyer Thank oh, you. Yeah. god bless Dyer but yeah <laughs> I mean we love to see Ingolo Conte when he scored. He smiled and made me cry. Everybody else cries, but it, it was it was so pretty, man. It may it, may, it can make a grown man cry. Yeah, it can. And then Rudiger, of course, with Timo assisting. If he can score, he will assist. What a beautiful oh. pass to Rudiger. I mean, yeah, I, I'm just proud of it. So. And, and that's what you gotta like about Chelsea's depth. Even though Kai and Mason out weren't working out, Man's brought on Conte and Timo. Too cool. And too cool. Too cool. Tuchel is just legit. Mm-hmm. He, if he doesn't win uh, manager of the year again, I don't know who will. I mean, he's, he's been doing absolutely amazing. Yeah. Big credit to him. Okay. Big credit to him. All right, let us move on to uh, España, where there is the La Liga currently right now. Real Madrid in Ooh, first la. place. Yeah, a lot. <laughs> Atletico Madrid <laughs> in second place. Valencia in third place. Real Sociedad in fourth place, followed by Atletico Club. In fifth place. Yeah, I mean, Atletico Madrid, Real Madrid, and where's Barcelona? Tenth place. (laughs) (sighs) My heart. Let's not talk about it, please. But then again, they (laughs) haven't played a game. They play a game tomorrow, so they could probably catch up into tenth place. I mean, to fourth place. But, yeah, you never know. And we're getting Ansu Fonti back as well. Along with the the belly. With the Travis Scott haircut, too. So, even better. (laughs) Oh, yeah. Oh, Fortnite. Yeah. What? Oh, yeah. Yes, Fortnite, of course. Also, <laughs> Callum Hudson and Doy got the same haircut, the Travis Scott haircut, too. No way. Yes, I know. It's If you go on his Instagram, it was a shocker. But, hey, he can pull off. He's he's a he's a nice-looking lad. He's, hey, handsome man. Uh, is he 18? I have to be careful with my words. Okay. Okay, so <laughs> <laughs> it was match day five for La Liga. Celta Vigo, Cadez, one to two for Cadez. Rayo Vallecano. Why am I saying it in an Italian accent? And Gafate? G- G- because it is splendid. Okay. <laughs> G- G- Getafe, 3 to 0 for Real Valagano. Atletico Madrid and Atletico Club, 0 to 0. Griezmann. What are you doing, man? You came back to a better club, and I mean, you're, um, they're in 10th place, so hey, fair. Atletico Madrid <laughs> with a red card. Elche and Levante, 1 to 1. Alaves and Asuna. Uh, As- Osasuna. Oh, I am so sorry, everybody. <laughs> zero to two for Osasuna. Molorica and Villarreal, zero to zero. Real Sociedad Sevilla, zero to zero. Euro Betes and Espanol, two to two. Real Betes with a red card. Valencia and Real Madrid, one to two. Benzema coming in clutch, of course. What do you expect? I mean, Benzema. And Barcelona and okay. Granada tomorrow. I swear, you must have a. Um... South American girlfriend, because your 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 accent's spot on, dude. I swear. I I get around, <laughs> buddy. <laughs> no, no, no. I, I the only place I get around is around my Xbox and around the gym because man, I am looking absolutely pun. Okay, I don't know what I'm on about. Okay, so what game did you watch? From? <laughs> In La Liga? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I watched the uh, Real Madrid versus um. Ooh, I forget their name. Valencia, yes. Yeah, so it was actually. It was a good game because um, it was it was a uh, blah. Real Madrid had come back, I think, down zero to one, oh. um, and so and it was actually Vinicius and Benzema that saved the game. And, Vinicius and, again, Man. Oh yeah, Vinicius. I think has scored three goals in the past. Wait, no, four goals in the past, like four or five games. 
He's on fire. Damn. Oh, yeah. He's, he's actually proving his worth, unless, unlike Mariano, who came to the team yeah. a couple years back. That's true. Bad. Yeah. I mean, they, they he, he's – did do you did they bring him in from Brazil or did they is he a homegrown? No, he he's came from Brazil, did he? I'm pretty sure he came from Brazil. Okay, okay, yeah. Like one of those clubs that um Neymar used to be on, I think actually that Ooh, same club. Santos. I think it was on Santos. Or was that really? I could be wrong. Hmm. No, I'm pretty. It was Santos. It was Santos for okay. Neymar. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. But hey, I mean Real Madrid. What do you expect at the top of the table with Benzema? Benzema's always going to be one of the top goal scorers for them. So. There's oh, yeah. not really anyone that contests with Real Madrid besides Atletico Madrid right now. I mean, Barcelona, they're going to... Mm. If Barcelona could just stay healthy yeah. and get some new defenders, because let's be real, mm. Busquets and Gerard are getting old. Gerard? Moreno. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Gerard Piquet. Yeah. Oh, wow. Well, okay, so Moreno. This dude. Mm-hmm. Okay, but yeah, I agree with that. Okay, let us move on to the beautiful Bundesliga. Hello. Uh-uh. Ah, uh-uh. I don't. I doubt they say that. Apparently. I'm sorry, they did not say that. <laughs> okay, but nine. Yes, there you go. Nine, nine. That's okay. That's probably bad. Okay, Bayern Munich in first place. Wolfsburg in second place. Wolfsburg keeping their spot up there. Wow, good job, Wolfsburg. But they did tie today, so that's the reason they're in uh, second place now. Dortmund in third place. Bayern Leverkusen in fourth place. And Mainz in fifth place. Mainz still keeping up the spot. Good job for them. Okay, so huh, Hertha Berlin in fourth. Two to one for Hertha Berlin. Bayern Munich and BFL Bochum. Seven to zero for Bayern. Dominating, of course. Robert Lewandowski scoring. Sane scoring two. Chupu Moting scoring one. I mean, the other team got an own goal because why not? Because they felt bad and they wanted to get in on the fun. But yeah. It is Augsburg and Borussia Mönchengladbach, one for Augsburg, zero for Borussia Mönchengladbach, Mainz, zero to zero, Ooh, with Freiburg, Armenia and Hoffenheim, zero to zero, Kron and RB Leipzig, one to one, RB Leipzig slacking, actually, because, of course, when you sell your, your best players to Bayern Munich, what happens? And also your other brother, Upen Kamel to Bayern Munich, and Sabitzer. <laughs> And as well, Konate to Liverpool. So, Jeez. yep, it is how it is. And Stuttgart and Leverkusen, 1-3 to three for Bayern Leverkusen. Dortmund and Union Berlin, 4-2 to two for Dortmund. The robot coming in clutch, of course. What do we expect? And Wolfsburg and right. Eintracht Frankfurt, 1-1. Eins eins. Good for Eintracht Frankfurt. Ah, they're in 15th place, but that was a second battle. It was still good. Okay, so, <clears throat> Holland. How how how's he how how's how is he doing? Magical genius. Yeah. The next coming of a faster little ton. Ooh. I, Ooh. The the way he touched the ball at the end of the game to seal the deal for the T for Dortmund was insane. It was an angle I've never seen anyone do before. It was Latam worthy. Zlatan Zlatan would approve. He would approve. Oh yeah, he would approve. I mean Holland, will he ever be better than Zlatan? That is a question. Will Holland win an actual Champions League, unlike Zlatan? Zlatan's never won Champions League, so that, so, is, that is a test. Depend, depending on which squad he goes to, which young squad, because if he goes to Chelsea, well, he, couldn't get, he can't, won't go to Chelsea anymore. But if he goes to, I think, Madrid, he has Vinicius, and yep. he has Asensio, imagine, pretty young squad. Imagine Holland, Lukaku. <laughs> oh, my gosh. That'd be insane. <laughs> Oh my god, that would hurt. That would hurt my head. That be the amount of service he would get at Bruma Drew would be pretty nice. Yeah, that's true. That is true. Okay, well, we move on from the Holland and Lewandowski League to Serie A, where our hands are going like this because it's coming to Rome. It's coming to Rome. Yeah. It's coming to Rome. It's coming to Rome. Coming to Rome. <laughs> okay, so Inter Milan is in first place. Milan, AC Milan, second place. Third place, Roma. And fourth place, Napoli, followed by Florentina, which is in fifth place. It was a great, great weekend for Inter. Everything went in their way. Sassuolo and Torino, 0-1 to for Torino. Genoa and Florentina, 1-2 to for Florentina. Inter Milano and Bologna, 6-1 to one for Inter Milano. Oh, my gosh. Jeez. What do you expect? It's a great team, even though they did sell Lukaku, but... 
they are still doing big boy. in the first place. Yeah, the big boy that is helping <laughs> Chelsea. Yes. And oh, I'm gonna get this wrong. Salernitan. <laughs> Banana. Banana. Do you want to try that one? Wait. Oh, uh, say it one more time. I'm trying. I'm gonna. I'm gonna try to re- re- see what you said. Salernitan. Salernitada. Sure. Akuna Matata. I'm, I'm a. Akuna Matata. Yes. Okay, and Atlanta, zero, the one for Atlanta. I'm so glad I didn't have to say their name again. Empoli mm-hmm. and San zero to three for San Pizzoro. Venezia and Spezia, two to one for Spezia. Lazio and Caligari. Uh, Cal, uh, Cag, Cal, oh, I'm so sorry. Cagliari. I'm going to get better at these guys. I'm sorry. Two to two for both teams. And Verona and Roma, three to two for, Ro- for Verona. I mean, Tammy Abraham scoring a goal, of course. So, big up, Tammy. Once a blue, always a blue. That hey. doesn't make any sense, but hey, good job, Tammy. And Juventus. And think, what do you say? I think I, I think I can pronounce it, by the way. I'm looking at it right now. Can okay. I get another try? Oh, yeah, go ahead. Salerni, Salernitana. <laughs> that sounded so... That's... Oh, my gosh. It's, like you said earlier, Kuna Matata. Let's move on. <laughs> you got to do it with an accent, though. It's Salernitana. <laughs> Salernitana. There we go. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Okay. Juventus and AC Milano, one to one. And Udinese and Napoli play tomorrow. Inter Milan, of course, on top. I mean, with a loss like Lukaku, you can only do so much, but they are keeping it up with Latoro Martinez over there. So glad he didn't go to um, Tottenham. Oh my gosh, to ruin his career. But okay. Mm-hmm. That was Serie A going to Ligue 1, which is the Messi League. Basically, it's the messy league. I mean, I don't know if anybody yeah. ever watches any games. I'm just kidding. I, I, I do watch other games. Okay, so PSG in first <laughs> place. What do we expect? Buying the league, buying the world. Marseille. Oil money. <clears throat> Oil money, indeed. indeed. And in second place, Lens in third place, Angus in fourth place, and Nice following in fifth place. So it was a interesting. I, I could say interesting, but I did not watch most of it. I mean, Lots of ties and lots of upsets, as we will talk about. So, okay, so Strasbourg and Metz, 0-3 for Strasbourg. Lens and Deal, 1-0 for Lens. saint Indian and Bordeaux, 1-2 for Bordeaux. Nice and Monaco, 2-2. Angers and Nantes, 1-4 for Nantes. Toys and Montpellier, 1-1 for Montpellier. Oh, it was a tie. Yeah, I don't know why I'm saying that. But Red Card for Montpellier. Clermont's Foot and Best. One to one, and a red card for Clermont Foot, and Rimes and Loyen zero to zero, Marseille and Rennes, Rennes two to zero for Marseille, and PSG and Lyon. One of the games of the weekend, as I will say, PSG with the two and Lyon with the one. What do we got to say about that? I don't know if you watched this game, but yikes! I can only say yikes about this game. I mean, for Messi, it's. He's he's he he was he had a couple of chances where he should have done better, but I think mean, for the most part he did all all right. But it is worrying that he hasn't had any goals or assists yet. I mean that's um, the reason uh, people watch it. Yeah. Oh yeah, and unlike uh, Cristiano Ronaldo, who's I think scored five and four, it's kind of worrying for us Messi fans out there. Yeah, I mean, what what is? <sighs> yeah, honestly. Man. I mean, he, Messi doesn't play like the out and out striker though. He plays more like a oh, like, yeah. floating mid attacking midfielder. So he's just, a false nine. Yeah, he's just there for the vibes. Let's let's be honest. <laughs> yeah, he's the old man coach there. Or the yeah. old man. I mean, he, I, I I feel like people are giving more stick than he is, but to give him more goals. But what can you do with a new team that you have no chemistry with? I mean, there's Neymar. That is also very you strange. Play with him for like ages. So there's only so much you oh, can yeah. do. But there was a spark of their old friendship, though, because there's a, a very unique back heel that Neymar did that almost let Messi score. Yeah. Is Messi falling off? Do you think Messi's falling off? I don't think Messi's falling off. I think it's like you said earlier, just no chemistry. It's just because the thing about with Messi is he has to have chemistry in order to do well with the team. But Ronaldo's more of an out and out, all out striker. Yeah, of course. Where you can kind of just put him up top to just kind of get in goals. Yeah. And that's his most of his goals he's had. Like, I mean, where like they're like um, either like very close to the keeper or they're like slightly given right in front of him, or 
it's just a shot deflection and he's just there to tap it in. I mean, I'm not saying he's a tap in like uh, Pinaldo and tap in stuff, but he does mm-hmm. what he has to do. He just taps it in. Right. And that's how he made his career. I mean, good for him, honestly. So that's, that's his job. job. Yeah. He did his job well. He does. Okay. Well, let us go on to the memes. Football memes of the week brought to you by. That is not the football memes of the week, but that was a good that was a good meme. <laughs> okay, <laughs> brought to you by Troll Football and Football Memes for the Lads. This is Emil Heskey, and let us see the lovely first meme. What do you think about this one? <laughs> Remember from Leon Ooh. Durista, lifting trophies builds muscles. Oh god, Harry Kane. Oh my god, Harry Kane. You, yeah. <laughs> Harry Kane. Wink if you're okay. Well, that... <laughs> Never. <laughs> Bro, but look at Leon Goreska. That what a man! I know. Don't don't, don't simp for him. I mean, yeah. That's... <laughs> okay, I'm kind of, we're okay here. Okay, so let us see the second <laughs> meme of the week. I mean, just kidding, because that is for the next episode, guys. And thank ooh you. La la. Yes, ooh la la. Thank you guys for watching the show, and Ronnie, thank you as well for being here, and also your friend Edu Mendy. I know it was great for him to sit out and recover after his injury in the Champions League. So. Thank you for being wait, here. Wait, wait. Min- Mindy is going to be better. It's going to take me a little bit of time. Wait, wait, wait. That is good. I am happy to hear, and I am very happy, and I'm not going to explain what type of happiness I have, but thank you for being <laughs> here. And as we say at the Goldman Goal Show, like, subscribe, and I said like. Is that even a word? I'm not going to look that up because that could it's be a new bad. word. It's a new word. <laughs> okay. Okay, well, let's go with that. <laughs> like, subscribe, and share, guys, because sharing is caring. And be caring. Look at Chelsea. They're carrying the league. <laughs> okay, sorry. That's, I mean, Manchester United ends it up there. Preach. Same points. But, yeah, guys, share, please. And as we say in this show, in three, two, one, one love football. Football is life. It is life. Thank you. And Danny bye. Rojas, Danny Rojas. <laughs> yes, shout out to Basso for the Emmy. Okay, thank you guys and bye bye.